Hey, what's up, guys? This is Mark Williams coming to you live on my own channel, Volume One. And I always want to talk to you about uh, something that happened to me uh, last month, um, and it was my wisdom teeth removable. Uh, can't say it. My wisdom teeth remove a bug. Anyways, well, a lot, I saw a lot of YouTube videos and when I was going to get it done and freaked me out. So I'm going to try and make one that's just normal and sort of funny too as well. See, so yeah, um, my experience for my recent teeth removal was quite interesting. Um, on January the 27th, I got my teeth removed somewhere in Mississauga. Uh, it was my 38, which is the bottom one, and my 18, which is the top. I still have another one here that's still in my mouth. Uh, and yeah, I why I'm making this video for because I've seen a lot of other videos talking about wisdom teeth and everybody was like, ah, I'm gonna die, ah! And then they had like a whole, they're like, ah! So it was just too glorified and that freaked me out too as well when I watched it and I was just watching trying to get information about getting your teeth removed and I saw these punky videos that made me like, I'm like, oh no. The, my teeth are gonna get removed, I'm gonna look like these people, I'm gonna be crazy in the head. But technically, I was not. So I'm gonna tell you my experience. Um, on January the 27th, uh, that was last month of 2011, um, got my teeth removed and I went somewhere in Mississauga. When I got my teeth removed, before I got that in, I was researching about it, and that's why I saw all these crazy videos, and that freaked me out. And then when I went to, to book my appointment, I was like, okay, I need a couple of days off from work or anything I'm doing, like here's the world stuff, or just work in general. So that's why I choose the 27th of January, it was like the end of the month, and it was on Thursday. So I was like, okay, Thursday, Friday. And then I just thought in my head, I'm like, I got the weekend to recover. So when I researched, um, I asked the dentist or the orthodontist, the people who are going to take the teeth out of my mouth, about can I get the medicine first before I get the teeth done? And they said, yeah, sure. So you can do that. You can actually get the medicine before you go get the teeth done. Um, so got, went to do a checkup and find out. Um, well, first you have to go through assessment. And then they assess you and see if they, what, what they have to do and how much it's going to cost you. And that gonna, that's going to cost some money. And after that, then they, then they can do a, uh, say that, okay, you can go get these things first before you get teeth out. So I want to get the medicine first, and but you should get that first because when you get teeth out, you don't wait in line. That medicine takes a long time to actually get put together or anything. So you don't want to get your teeth out and then you're like, hey, 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 waiting for the medicine, going, ah, my mouth's loud. No, not good. Um, so on 27th, got my teeth out that day and the experience around that was so hilarious. Uh, I went in there, all freaked out because of videos after that. Um, walked in with my medicine, talked to, got a whole insight of what's going on. Uh, and then uh, this nurse came out and goes, you know what, I'm gonna help you with this. You know, Mark, where's the place you wanna go? Oh, where were you from? Like Barbados? And they're like, oh, you're, you're you're from Barbados. Oh, that's nice. You want to go to the beach? You'll be going to the beach. I didn't go nowhere. I didn't go to no freaking beach. Knocked out. Knocked out like, like I was dead. And I was like, if that was how death was, that was very... That was, that was like when I was, I go to sleep. I don't really dream that much. It was hilarious. I thought I was going to go to the beach. I didn't go to the beach. I want my money back. I'm joking. 
But anyways, so after I got knocked out by getting the laughing gas and a needle, I wake up another area, another room, all days down and confused. Two teeth pulled out. Also, get it done when you're younger because it's not going to cost that much money. Um, but anyways, um, so when I got my teeth done, I'm all dazed out, numb down the mouth, go home, because I got my medicine first already, and they get some information about what to not do and what to do. When you get your teeth done, do not go give you a dry socket, don't drink, I mean don't drink a straw, guys gonna mess you up too as well, and what was another thing that told me? So don't go, don't cough, try not to cough, try not get sick e either. I know it's gonna be hard to do, not to do that. And also do not sneeze, um, because any blowing activity will pull out all the blood clot and then you have a dry socket. I heard that's bad. Don't do it, don't do it. You wanna go back to to dentist and get your freaking mouth repaired. Anyways, um, after that, um, uh, my face starts swelling up. Look like this picture here. Look like a monkey, man. I don't know what the hell. I look like a freaking drug addict. I don't know. I look like a crackhead. Anyways, so after getting those teeth out, I had to take my medicine. First, when you when you get your when you as soon as you get home, take the the tunnel three. Looks sort of like like this. So take Tylenol 3 first. Uh, I didn't finish it because this thing can mess you up. It's, fucking, it's prescription drugs. But anyways, first of this, take this. Um, after that, you have to actually take this here. It's called Via Oxygen. I can't even say the name. I'll just put the name here and you can read it. Yeah, it's called that. Um, this here is the second thing, but you have to take it all the time. Three, it says take one capsule three times daily until finished. You gotta finish this. This, this, um, why did it put labels on top? See, it says second on this one. Uh, tying all three of the first, and then there's a last one that they gave me was this one here which is some orange stuff. Uh, I think ibuprofen. I for the third, because this one here is only for if it's really major pain and also, uh, I think, stops affection. But, yeah. But this one here, the second one, which I can't even, can't even say the damn name, this one is the one where it's supposed to heal you up. But just time it out. Don't take them all at the same time. Just Go one in the morning and then wait a couple hours, like three or four hours, then take the next one just to get through your system, you know? Uh, another thing too as well, they're gonna give you this kind of weird liquids. I can't even say the damn name. Anyways, this 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 thing is like Listerine. It doesn't taste that bad. A lot of people said it tastes disgusting, whatever. But this it tastes that bad to me. Um, uh, you also dr not drink it. What I'm saying, you also wash your mouth with this because it's supposed to get rid of infection too as well. One in the morning, and then one at night. Um, in the middle of the day, you can use like water to wash your mouth or salt water. But they're gonna give you this too as well, and this syringe that looks like a hooper scooper thing. Uh, it's supposed to wash out the certain areas, but don't even use this yet. Just wash with the Listerine thing. Don't even use this yet because you want this to heal first before you start squeezing water inside this, squeezing water inside the certain places. You'll mess yourself up if you use this. Start washing out the damn blood. When you start healing up and her face starts swelling down, then use this. Um, I use some salt water, and but you have to wait for a couple a week. Give yourself like two weeks maybe at least to start using this thing. But yeah, um, after our using this thing up and finishing your medicine, your mouth will go down too as well. That's 
pretty much it. Oh, you guys want to see the teeth? Disgusting, eh? I know this is going to be nasty. But the two teeth. Well, this one's from... From the top here. I'll tighten that thing in. Man. And the other one that's just broken in half. That, that was down here. Make sure you get your teeth removed or it's going to look like this. I mean, early. You don't want to wait too late. But anyways. So, uh, I hope I helped you guys. I helped you guys. Um, is your wisdom teeth removable? And my experience is not that bad. Start some, took some of that. that when you take those medicines, you start seeing things too as well. You're, whatever. You gotta get it done sometime. All right. But that's it for now. Talk too much. I talk too much, so I'll let you guys go and take care. All right. Peace. Smile. One.